It is an extra special Sabbath because today there will be a baptism. Let's see. Uh, quiero invitar a mi amigo Luis Viegas. I'd like to invite my, my friend Luis and his family to come and join me here at the front. I believe there are more. Don't be shy. Come and join us. I think they, they are everywhere. They are everywhere. They are making preparations, perhaps. But here, come with me here, Luis. Let's face, face the congregation, if you would. Come right here next to me. Uh-huh. Yes, please. Come on up. Don't be shy. Yes, yes. It is better to travel together, amen? This afternoon, late afternoon at 5.30 uh, at uh, the Feltman's house on the river there at the end of Battlefield Bluff, uh, we will be having a baptism for Luis. Luis, this has been many months in the making. You have been coming to our church and uh, that has been a blessing. A profound blessing has been this group and there's more, I know there are more coming, uh, that has been part of a group that you have been studying with uh, preparing for this day. Uh, your background, uh, you have a Catholic background, uh-huh. uh, you moved here to the valley. Um, I do not know the story of how you met these people. I'm curious, Would you, can you tell us briefly how, it, how, how did you come into contact with this group? Okay, um, I was moving to the area around four years ago. Forty, okay. Yeah, and all my life, of course, I was uh, seeking for, for God and for bless, but no matter that I was getting instructed uh, as a Catholic in, 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 uh, in the school and also in, in the church from my seven, eight years old, I was feeling like I was not enough. And sometimes I was thinking, wrongly thinking that I, I was knowing a lot about religion. But uh, after looking for different church, I was uh, almost losing the hope. I was thinking everything is the same. Then I, one day I was walking around the new market and one of the ladies that's not here that was invited me here. When I come, the first day I come to the study at 9.30, I listen to something new. I think, where do they find these things? Then next Saturday I, I listened to two things that was new for me. And that was incredible because in that time I was feeling like I am, <laughs> I know a lot. You knew now, it all. No, yes. I, I feeling embarrassing thinking like that. I really feeling embarrassing right now to say that I was thinking that I know a lot. Then I was exciting about new things. Then I was coming more and I, I think I get blessed to, to, to come to this church and also to meet this uh, exceptional family that now with me. Amen. Amen. Well, Luis, we praise the Lord that he has led you here. All are invited to come and join us uh, at the Feldman's house. Uh, if, you have, uh, if you have some physical limitations, you are welcome to uh, drive down the hill. Otherwise, we're asking that everybody walk down to preserve the grounds that are there. I anticipate that there will be a good crowd to come and celebrate what the decision that you're making. I want to read through the baptismal vows here, and Luis, Uh, You and I have looked through these together, Mm -hmm. but as your public testimony here, I want to read through these. And if this is what you believe, if you would just say yes after each one, Mm -hmm. let me begin. My commitment, number one, I believe there is one God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, a unity of three co-eternal persons. Yes, I believe. Secondly, I accept the death of Jesus Christ on Calvary as the atoning sacrifice for my sins, and believe that through faith in his shed blood I am saved from sin and its penalty. Yes, I believe. I renounce the world and its sinful ways and have accepted Jesus Christ as my personal savior, believing that God, for Christ's sake, has forgiven my sins and given me a new heart. Yes. Amen, amen. I accept by faith the righteousness of Christ, my intercessor in the heavenly sanctuary, and accept his promise of transforming grace and power to live a loving, Christ-centered life in my home and before the world. Yes, I accept. I believe that the Bible is God's inspired word, the only rule of faith and practice for the Christian. I covenant to spend time regularly in prayer and Bible study. Yes. I accept the Ten Commandments as a transcript of the character of God and a revelation of His will. 
It is my purpose by the power of the indwelling Christ to keep this law, including the fourth commandment, which requires the observance of the seventh day of the week as the Sabbath of the Lord and the memorial of creation. Yes, I ask him. I look forward to the soon coming of Jesus and the blessed hope when this mortal shall put on immortality. As I prepare to meet the Lord, I will witness to his loving salvation and by life and word help others to be ready for his glorious appearing. Yes, I accept and believe. I accept the biblical teaching of spiritual gifts and believe that the gift of prophecy is one of the identifying marks of the remnant church. Yes, I accept. I believe in church organization. It is my purpose to support the church by my tithes and offerings and by my personal effort and influence. Yes, I accept. I believe that my body is the temple of the Holy Spirit and will honor God by caring for it, avoiding the use of that which is harmful, abstaining from all unclean foods, from the use, manufacture, or sale of alcoholic beverages, the use, manufacture, or sale of tobacco in any of its forms for human consumption, and from the misuse of or trafficking in narcotics or other drugs. Yes, I believe. I know and understand the fundamental Bible principles as taught by the Seventh-day Adventist Church. I purpose by the grace of God to fulfill His will by ordering my life in harmony with these principles. Yes. I accept the New Testament teaching of baptism by immersion and desire to be so baptized as a public expression of faith in Christ and his forgiveness of my sins. Yes. And finally, I accept and believe that the Seventh-day Adventist Church is the remnant church of Bible prophecy and that people of every nation, race, and language are invited and accepted into its fellowship. I desire to be a member of this local congregation of the World Church. Yes, I accept. And all God's people said. Is there a motion that pending his baptism we would accept him into membership into the New Market Church? I see enough for a first and a second. All those in favor, a hearty amen. amen. Luis, we praise the Lord for his work in your life. Thank you. 5.30 this afternoon. Will you be there? Yes. I will be there too. We hope that you are as well. Thank you. Thank you.